Hi Ace family and welcome to another top 10 video that is actually only a top 5 because I get a lot more information in a top 5 than a top 10. If you are a player that like to collect the unusual, strange and unique then this is the video for you. You can find weapons and armor that will not only make you the strongest person in Skyrim but also the best looking. This video is nothing about any of those. We are going to look at items that has no value, no armor rating, or damage. What makes these items unique is the name. Sit back, relax, get some adult juice and enjoy the video. First item we have is the Dancer's Flute. During your tour of the Calixto's House of Curiosities, Calixto Corium will explain to you that the flute has the power to make people dance uncontrollably. Calixto will nearly utter the phrase that is needed to make people dance, but will stop just before he starts the phrase. Don't let this innocent looking flute fool you, for this is the dancer's pipe. Legend holds that the dancer's pipe has won wars, toppled empires, and changed the very course of history. None know its origins, but the stories say that men who hear its music are compelled to dance uncontrollably, no matter the peril. To activate this strange power, one must only speak the magic words, which are Oh my, I very nearly got us both into a nasty predicament, didn't I? You will need to steal these items to obtain them. Just make sure that you finish the quest Blood on Ice as there is a glitch where if you are caught breaking into his house you will not be able to talk to him during the quest. 2 is Iska Moore's Soup Spoon. Wait a minute! What? This is a spoon. What well, duh? Like the dancer's flute, you can see Iskamor's soup spoon, that is actually a fork in Calixto's House of Curiosities. Interesting fact, the appearance, weight and price are completely identical to any other fork. Like the flute make sure that you steal this item after completing Blood on Ice. Ah, now here's an item out of legend. This is Iskamor's soup spoon. Now I know what you're thinking. This is no spoon, it's a fork. Nobody can eat soup with a fork. Well, my friend, you did not know Iskramor. Number 3 is Ancient Traveler's Skull. Between two mountains southwest of Winterhold and southeast of Dawnstar, in the location Wayward Pass, lies an Ancient Traveler. In this location you will find a skull called Ancient Traveler's Skull. This unique item looks exactly any other skull in Skyrim. With the skull you will find Arcade Shrine with an amulet and iron armor. Number 4 is Bulbous's Fork. During the Dark Brotherhood quest line the quest to kill an empire, you will acquire the Rite of Passage. If kept and interacting with Bulbous, an extra dialogue will come up where you tell Bulbous, I am the Gourmet. Balbus will respond with praise and offer his fork with some special ingredients. This fork looks like the weapon version of the fork, except that the fork has no weight and no value whatsoever. Before we get to the last item, if you like this video why not give it a like and subscribe. It takes me hours to create content like this. A like and subscribe means the world to me and it helps with the YouTube algorithm. Enough of that, let's get back to the video. Last item is Michaela's Flagon. Michaela's Flagon is a normal flagon that can be found in Morthal inside Thanir's house, right next to the fireplace. It looks like any other flagon in Skyrim, the only difference is the name. It has a value of 1 gold and weight of 0.5. That is it for today's video. If you enjoyed this video then you might enjoy these as well. Go check them out. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Cheers.